I... My YouTube channel has just turned two years old, so for that reason, I have decided to do a little special where I talk about how my YouTube channel started and how I got my name. So, I first started a YouTube channel December 10th, 2014, and I, I first started out as a drumming channel. Um, so, I, as you saw in the last video, I just re-released my drumming videos. So that's what I first started out as. Now I do, obviously, gaming, but my old channel's name was Type 1 Drummer because I'm a Type 1 diabetic, as most of you know. So I was Type 1 Drummer. So I made four drumming videos, but I only re-released three because the other one was terrible. Um, but then after I did those, I stopped until I found out that on QuickTime Player, on Mac, there was a thing called um, screen recording. So as soon as I found out that existed, then that's when I started and I made a few, or like two videos, and they were pretty terrible because I had just started. But they have progressively gotten better. And um, so I think I made, I don't know, but I did a couple gaming videos and then I stopped for like maybe five months and then I started making some more and those were already getting better. Um, and then after those videos, uh, then I stopped again for a while and then I was kind of thinking and I was like maybe I want to change my YouTube channel because I was like I'm not really into making drumming videos anymore and my channel name is Type 1 Drummer so I was like maybe I should kind of start over so that's what I did but the way that I got this name was I was in Spanish class, I was researching the Dominican Republic with my friend and then we came across a creature called a Hispanolian Solenodon, which is a very small rodent. It's a very small, cute rodent. But um, then I was kind of thinking about the name and I was like, that sounds like a dinosaur and it sounds like it'd be really intimidating. So I just kind of made that my YouTube channel name because I thought it was kind of an interesting name. So now that's what my YouTube channel is called. And that's how it always will be. But I was just on my computer this morning and I was kind of playing around with some designs for logos. So I came up with this one. I'll pop it on screen over. <clears throat> but that was a little thing that I'll mess around with. I'll probably do a little bit more with that stuff and just maybe like feature them in some YouTube videos. And then if you have any opinions on them, then you can maybe like comment or something just being like, you should use this as your new logo, which I don't really, I'm not really sure if I want to change my logo right now because it's like, I've only had it for a little bit. And, and if you're wondering where like the, um, if you're wondering where the other YouTube videos are um, from my old channel, they're still on this channel but they're unlisted because I'm not really happy with how they turned out. So that's mostly it. And I don't really know 
what else I will- I might do a react to old videos because I'll probably die <laughs> watching those because I really don't like watching myself which is kind of hard trying to edit these things because I have to watch it to know where I made mistakes and stuff or if I need to re-record which kind of makes it a huge like cringe fest so <laughs> yeah that's mostly it just a small little like thank you for the support and I'm not gonna be one of those pe one of the like youtubers that and they're like make me get to a hundred subscribers and then I'll do like a thank you thing. I'm gonna do it probably every year at on this day and hopefully yeah I have plenty of time to upload this because I, I want to make sure that it comes out today. So I'll put a link in the description of the first video that I ever uploaded and it's favorite video but it's still fine but um just thank you guys for if anybody's still here that has been there from the beginning so thank you to those people and also thank you to new people so thank you for showing the support and thank you guys so much for watching and i'll talk to you later